Hey guys, Adam here at Alter Auto, here to do a walk around on our 2021 BMW 330i X-Drive that we just took in. If you come to the front, you'll see that it is an M Sport. The M Sport bumper, a little bit more aggressive than a regular bumper. It is equipped with black grills with the M Sport package. Headlights are the new BMW LEDs on the G bodies. M Sport also includes black mirrors. We have the M Sport wheels on it and black trim rather than chrome. As we come to the back of the vehicle, you'll see the M Sport rear bumper. The vehicle is also equipped with backup sensors, a backup camera, and the new styling of the G body. We'll take a look inside now and go over those features. Hey guys. Woo, it's slippery. Adam at Ultra Auto. I just wanted to show you the comfort access that I just used. You just put your hand on the door handle and it automatically recognizes that the key is in close proximity and opens the vehicle up. Now that we're on the inside of the vehicle, you can see that the M Sport package, you do get the upgraded M Sport steering wheel. There are M pedals below, and of course, M door sills when you open the doors. M Sport does include the paddle shifters on it. It's an eight speed transmission, inline four, four cylinder. You can see the new updated dash on the G body. Push button ignition right here. This vehicle is equipped with automatic high beams, cruise control, there are all the safety features, blind spot monitoring, lane departure warning, and front collision warning. As a standard feature, there is also accident avoidance. So the emergency braking, the vehicle will actually brake if it detects that you are about to get an imminent collision. One of the really uh, cool things about BMWs in general are these three different modes, Sport, Comfort, and Eco Pro. Uh, these will actually change the dynamics of the vehicle. When you go in sport mode, you'll see that the dash actually changes to a sport oriented uh, cluster. If I hit comfort, it'll change it. And if I go eco, it'll change it once again. Sport mode will tighten up the steering wheel, give it a more aggressive uh, feel to the driving. It'll let you actually rev the entire v uh, motor out to redline. Comfort mode, a little bit more regular driving around the city uh, and the steering wheel feel kind of loosens up a little bit. And then Eco Pro, that will actually reduce the amount of power. Shift points become a lot quicker and steering of course is a little bit looser than uh, if you were in the sport mode. We'll take a look at the sunroof right now. It has a large sunroof. It does have an automatic shade. You can stop this at any point just by clicking the button again, or you can have it completely closed. The sunroof is equipped with a vent feature in the button right here in the middle. Hit that, it'll crack it open. And of course, one touch, full open. One of the nice things BMW did too, they put a little wind deflector here just to prevent any kind of oscillating noise within the cabin. Rear view mirrors are all auto dimming. So if you ever have somebody with uh, BMW headlights blinding you, well, the good news is you will not be affected. So we'll turn our attention to the new iDrive system. It's all touch screen. You can access different uh, information on the vehicle. Uh, right here, this is vehicle status. It'll show you different uh, maintenance reminders, um, stuff that uh, is about to be required on the vehicle navigation, communication, it's all accessible simply by touch, or you can use the dial down here on the iDrive system to choose the same kind of settings. The new shifter uh, in the center console, put it in reverse, you'll see the new backup camera, put it in park right there. This vehicle is equipped with a auto stop start feature. Uh, when you come to a red light, the vehicle will shut itself off, save some fuel, and then start back up. You can turn that on and off at uh, your liking just by hitting that button. 
Park sensors are controlled with this button right here. And then this one, Auto H, is one of my favorite features. It's Auto Hold. So when you're at a light, if you click that button, you can actually take your foot completely off the brake and it will hold the vehicle in place for as long as you want until you give the vehicle gas. Some more features in the center console. It is equipped with a phone charging pad and a USB. Heated seats and of course a heated steering wheel, always welcome in our climate. We'll move to the back seats now and I'll show you that. Now we'll focus on the seats. M Sport does have an upgraded seat compared to non M Sport. You have larger bolsters that are adjustable at the touch of these buttons. These side bolsters will inflate to give you a more snug feel. And the lower bolster here does extend out to give you some leg support on longer drives or more spirited drives. In the back seat, lots of room. There's also climate controls for any passengers along with some charge ports. As we come to the back, you see a large trunk and the seats do fold flat. Believe it or not, some 3 Series do not have a fold flat feature. This one does. It's what you call a 40-20-40 split. It can be just one side or the other or just the middle ski through or all of them. With all the seats folded flat, you have tons of room if you need it. If you'd like to schedule a viewing, please feel free to give me a call. The number to reach me is 780-910-9347.